Here we go again. Ah, never bring case, please. <laughs> ah, this time, however, this time, I have a surprise for you. <laughs> Oh yeah, you never saw that coming, did ya? Huh? Huh? Stuck-up Imperial bastard? Huh? <laughs> you never saw that coming. The hell are you doing? She was just trying to say hello to the table, and you just had to come over here and start slapping her fucking side. Okay, well that's fun. Hello everyone, I'm Garrett Oak Amber. Welcome back to Skyrim Special Edition. This is a different save. This is something that I've been wanting to do for the longest time. Uh, this is a different character than my last one, who was a dragon. vampire. This is a different series. This character is going to be a werewolf. And if you couldn't guess by the title, this werewolf is going to be using the brand new released um, Moonlight Tales mod for Skyrim. Nope. What is Sorry. Moonlight Tales? If you don't know, it is probably the coolest werewolf mod in existence. Um, the reason being is mostly because it adds so many goddamn features to werewolves. Uh, included in the special edition version, as of right now, there's a completely different perk tree. Completely different. So everything is different for werewolves this time around. And it's pretty cool. Um, it basically makes them the monsters they should be. Um, also, I have lightsabers because I really wanted to do a Star Wars themed Skyrim series and well, that didn't exactly work out because the mod that I was going to install, um, I was trying to find the source mod from where it came, but apparently that mod got deleted a while ago. There's a mod that replaced all the Imperials with Stormtroopers. And I found the only existing copy of it was part of a combination mod. Unfortunately, none of them work. I'm not kidding. They don't work. Um, combination mods fuck everything up. I literally, it literally hard crashed Skyrim, and I had to basically just I had to uninstall a good deal of things just to get it to work. My saves are intact. My data, my data from the other saves are intact. That's a saber cap. Hi. Everything is intact. But, um, I didn't get to do what I wanted to do, which was going to be a very cool Star Wars themed... Star Wars themed Skyrim experience, so... But, thankfully, the werewolf mod came out, finally, so I was excited about that. I said, hey, yeah, I'm gonna play that, because, fuck yeah, <laughs> I've been waiting for Moonlight Tales. And the only thing I'm disappointed is that the werewolf infection system isn't right now in the game. It will be. Ooh. Oh, we're gonna turn. We need to get off the road in case somebody sees us. Oh, God. Oh, we're gonna turn. Here we go. <laughs> Moonlight Tales, away! <laughs> but I love the uh, infection system from Moonlight Tales, and it's not currently in game, so it's really sad. Doesn't matter. Ah, oh, look at us. We are a werewolf. Currently, the uh, other forms of werewolves are not in the game either. There's like the Femlacana, which I was probably gonna use um, to make her look more feminine as a werewolf. Because a werewolf that doesn't. It, this is clearly a male werewolf. It just looks a little off. But, um, yeah, there's quite a few things that are not currently in this build. And I would like them to be. So, I have it set so that every night I turn, like Morrowind's werewolves. And I liked Morrowind's werewolves. I liked them a lot. Um, I have no. No personal issue with turning every night. I know it can be a little annoying at times, but I think this is pretty cool. You kill these people. We don't have any perks yet, so kind of weak. Shoot me in the face, I'm fine. Oh. 
We're gonna try, though. Oh, it's an afflicted. Wow. What is he doing here? Doesn't matter. He's eating. <laughs> oh, damn. There's a lot of people around here. Oh, is that part of the Skyrim Wars mod? Yeah. Totally is. Yeah, there's probably some shit going down that I'm not a part of. Hey. Did you just not fire arrows at me? Wow. Alright, here we go again. Hopefully this time we don't end up dead. <laughs> uh, werewolves are not easy to begin with. Um, something that's an improvement in this Moonlight Tales that wasn't in the original is the ability to regenerate your health as a werewolf passively. Um, like an additional regeneration. Unfortunately, you have to unlock that, so you have to kill people to do it. So you have a progression system as a werewolf. I kind of wish these developers, these independent modders, would create some sort of... I don't know, how, how do you say a uh, guy? I can search him and take shit. Uh, werewolf looting is on, which is awesome. I kind of wish there was a paragon level system for werewolves that increases, like... After you get the max per perk points, you can just basically dump your perk points into a percentage of damage or, you know, stamina or something like that. It'd be kind of cool. But I can see why the game doesn't have that. It's not like Diablo. It's not designed around that. So we're going to save. we got to do some hit-and-run tactics here to actually make a difference. Just killing them would be nice. Yes, I hear you. Ain't this a surprise? I know, right? Big fucking surprise. You're dead. Just eat you because you're up here. You didn't like that. If you're wondering what that mist is, um, that's actually a visual cooldown reduction for knockbacks, but I have that turned off so I can stagger them as much as I want. Well, never mind, didn't seem to work. There are bugs! Ooh. <laughs> I guarantee you're not gonna like this. Holy shit! Are you kidding me? Ouch. They have some powerful spells. Let's try to stay uh, as far away from them as we can. We need to eat these bodies, though. Or we can just die. Fucking Imperial. Die. There we go. I submit. I submit, please. Oh, God. <laughs> you're, you're annihilated. No, I want to eat him. I don't want to pick the fucking lavender. Yeah, there we go. It changed to soul claimed werewolf perk progress um, increased. So it's it's different than it was before. Uh, it's not heart consumed. Um, these are the perks. There's quite a lot, so I'm not going to go over them all. But the coolest ones are later on in the tree. Uh, you can learn this twice. Get yourself more damage and more health and shit. Um... You can feed off most dead creatures. And no perk progress off of creatures anymore because they want you to hunt people instead. Um, giving you a buff to your actual werewolf form is amazing, but there's also human form uh, thing. Wait, what? Spring enemies knocks down most targets. Oh, that's cool. I like that. Um... Where are... Yeah, here is human form. You gain a buff that you can activate. Things like that. There's some human form things, which are really cool. And I like that. I like that a lot. Because normally, you have to uh, actually be in werewolf form for any of your perks to actually function properly. Fuck your barriers! Oh, hi. How you doing, sir? I want to destroy the damn barriers because I don't like them. Oh, God! 
He hit me hard. Ah! <laughs> oh no! <laughs> Why? Alright, okay, there's a bandit behind me. How you doing? Oh, come on. <laughs> Fucking glitchy ass werewolf. Come on. Okay, this this fucking no knockback shit is pissing me off. I thought I turned it off. Clearly not. I see you firing at me. Is that a silver bow? Is that why I'm dying so easily? Nope. Just be a normal bow. I'm just gonna eat you. Holy shit! What the fucking arrows? Fuck off! Really? Stop it! You're so mean! Ow! <laughs> okay, I have to kill some creatures and get my nourishment back. If that even will give me nourishment. I don't know if it will or not. Alright, how you doing? I'm gonna claw you to death? Don't mind me! I'm just behind you, ripping you to pieces! Got banded up there straight ahead, looking to get a shot on me. He can't quite. Oh, we got two, two, three bandits. Three. Three bandits down here. If I can get him at a choke point, I have an advantage. That's probably not gonna happen. Or we go inside here. <laughs> Take care of the bandits on the inside of the fort, work our way outwards. If they follow us, they're idiots. Um, we're going to save because I'm concerned about my wolfy nature. That's right, we can't eat creatures right now. I forgot. Hi. <laughs> mate. You're dead. It's okay. Shh. Get in my belly. Get in my belly. Just, just give me your food. You're delicious. Hey! The fuck you doing? Stop it! I slap you. Uh, yeah, don't, don't mind me. You just, you just go back to sleep. Just remember, this is watching you sleep. What the fuck is wrong with my eye? Oh, it's bloodied. Okay. <laughs> yeah, there we go. I was like, what the fuck is wrong with my eye? <laughs> That was off, to say the least. <laughs> that was interesting. You saw it here first. So we got ourselves a hero. I'm a fucking werewolf. Okay, that roar does nothing. Stop hitting me with arrows. Really fucking annoying. You? Num, 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 num. He's just waiting for me. You see that, right? He's got a fireball prime and ready. Fucker, 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 fucker. Really? No! <laughs> I gotta go for that mage as quickly as I can. You're dead. Mind me. You. We gotta find the mage. There you are. You don't get a chance to do what you did to us before. See, right now we're... Oh! Didn't realize I did that, but whatever, we'll do that. And I always forget to loot them. I mean, we can loot now. Open up the... It's locked. There is a mod to let me open up locked stuff, but I don't have that mod, so... That isn't gonna happen. It's kind of hard to see what you're looting, though, in third person. I really would like the first person mod again, but... Skeever. Ow! Ow! Okay. We have to go the other way around. 
I, I missed Moonlight Tales. And it's funny, because I can play it at any time. I have it on normal Skyrim, but... Um, with all the, you know, bells and whistles attached to it. Infection and shit like that, NPC events. It's not currently in this version, but the creator did express their interest in bringing it back. And I'm very glad they're going to bring it back, because the infection stuff was my favorite part of Moonlight Tales. Being able to create werewolf followers... This is bad, actually. No, no, stop, stop stabbing me. God. Okay, we got it. You're dead. You. I miss being able to infect people with, uh, like Trophy 2 because they would become your ally, basically, after you turn them into one of your own. They also gain the power to turn at will as well, so you could set it so you get into a fight, and there were other mods you could add on top of that, and you could have them have elaborate behaviors, like transforming whenever there's a fight, or whenever they reach a certain health threshold. Um, there's a chest. I'll take all of that, thank you. There's a lot of righteous, that's cool. Don't really care. Just going to... Uh, and there's a book. It's probably Song of the Rhetoran or whatever. Or Song of Plenel. Um, What's up on this tower again? Anything worth my while? Or is it all just Bungus? Dragon armor. It's a rune tower. Congratulations. <laughs> guy over there, though. Yeah, Don't you dare. Stop. Stop. She dead. Ow. No, don't, why are you freezing in place? Stop it. <laughs> that's my keyboard. That's not... You're gonna die. Yeah, you died. I was gonna say, there's no way you survived that. Fall damage is lethal to most NPCs. Please don't shoot me. I really don't like it. <laughs> Out of your element, aren't you? Yes, you are. You're mine. What I like about this new perk tree for uh, Moonlight Tales is that it makes the werewolf actually playable. But right now, as you can see, I'm having a lot of trouble being the werewolf. You fuckers! Killed him. Get our health back a little bit. Keep firing at us. Is there a jerk? Yeah. You're up here. Hi. What the fuck are you doing? Okay, she's down. Uh, now I can collect like, the body that went off the side. I think there was one other, but I can't remember where, so we're just not gonna bother looking for them. Found your body. Delicious. Nice sweet meat. Okay. Might as well take that. Um, we might as well go into Redoran's retreat and murder the bandits there. They're definitely powerful enough. Hi there, sir. Random Imperial soldier. For no good reason whatsoever. Hey, we got our first part. And it's definitely going into the damage, because we have no other point. It gives us a little bit of health, and increases the amount of health we gain from feeding, which is useful. Okay. 
seems like fires raging everywhere because everyone's at war for some reason. <laughs> because of the mod I installed. Oh, this is cool. I like this. I like this a lot. It's, it's kind of bringing back Marwin vibes, but without... Well, it's not, I mean, it's not exactly like Marwin because we actually have progression. There was no real progression with the werewolf outside of the hearsay stories, and even then, it ends at a certain point. Like, there's nothing more you can do. Um, we're gonna take your arrows, lockpicks and shit. There is a boss bandit in here we'll have to kill. That guy was easy. Here's the boss. And she got glitched. Which is actually good, because now she can't hurt us, but... Wow. She can't hurt us at all. You enjoy being back there? Oh, great. I just got a disease. <laughs> I thought I was immune to diseases. I'm supposed to be immune to diseases. Well, that's fun. Werewolves don't catch illnesses. This is a truth. Oh! Oh! Oh, God! That was... Oh, God! That's... Oh, no! That's fucking grisly! Ah! Uh, ah! Uh, ah! Uh. Oh, she got caught in the... F oh, I hit her so hard, she got melded into the metal. Oh my god, that's fucking nasty. Oh god. I'm not picking that up just yet. That usually appears in this chest. There's a good chance for it to appear here. I'm never surprised. That had to be the single goriest uh, bandit kill I've ever had. <laughs> Aside from shooting someone in the eye with the ki with the kill cam, that was probably the most gory death. Like she got twisted around and pulled into it, and she's bodies moving around, and then I start eating her, and all this blood's pouring out of her chest cavity. <laughs> oh my god! What I really like about this perk s system in general, like adding more perks and adding really interesting perks, is it's giving us the opportunity to not only benefit our werewolf, but benefit our human form as well. So this is a really good idea to give werewolves something that makes them more unnatural, as opposed to the vanilla werewolves, it's just like, you have a you have a power called beast form. You have beast form. Use beef, beast form. I almost said beefaroni. I want to say beefaroni, because I'm hungry, but... Um, <laughs> you want to use beast form to become the werewolf, and that's it. And it's like kind of boring, whereas vampires get all these little passive bonuses in the game. In this, with Moonlight Tales, you can become more powerful in human form as a werewolf. So there's more of a reason to become a werewolf. So when you're not using your beast form, you are still a werewolf. You're still powerful. Um, yes, 20 second cooldown. Was Roar of the Pack, two wolf members... That one's probably more useful. Um, wait, what does that say? Sorry. Okay, that's just uh, that's the detect life. So these are like souped up versions. And that one is, yeah. Moons are active at night. Your skills improve 20% faster. See, I don't really care about that, because we have it on Nightmare Mode, where every night we turn. So the skill improvement doesn't help, but the resistance does. That's actually useful. Um, so I think I have to... Oh, crutch. Ah, there we go. So this is kind of like having infected NPCs with us for the temporary amount of time that we have them. I would very much like to have that system in place, but right now I don't think it's going to happen just yet. Um, I believe it's Brevi who created this, said that they were going to have it for the initial release, but it wasn't added in, so expect to see an update in the following month, hopefully, that adds werewolf infection. 
God, that my my fucking werewolves are kicking ass. This is gonna get us some easy uh, werewolf perks. <laughs> as long as they don't eat the bodies. Did they kill one? They may have killed one of them. You're in my way. You're, you're kind of, sort of, in my way. Oh, and he's gone. So claimed. Okay. What I also like is I can have all three howls at once. I can summon by looking up. I can fear by looking across. Or I can detect life by looking down. Which is useful. Lunar Iron Sword. Lunar Armor Forging. We'll take that. Well, I'm not taking it. We're just learning what the book has to teach us. Take these. Uh, I might be over encumbered when I get to my human form. The werewolves have an amazing carry capacity. Um, same with the Vampire Lord. It's like basically a horse. It has a ridiculous amount of weight they can at once. Get some gold. Gold! I love gold! Well, I see this bug is ever prevalent. I can't loot him ever again. He's just floating in space. Santa Claus! What are you up to, Santa Claus? Let's try to get this camera here. I am Deckard Kane, also known as Santa Claus, and today I'm fucking dead. The hell have I walked in? Oh, wait, fuck you. <laughs> wait, wolves aren't supposed to attack me. Why did I just attack the wolf? <laughs> well, he might have attacked me because of the influence of the uh, sprig in there, but... I probably could have just let it go. Mmm, venison for my werewolf. Does that mean we have an inventory? No, we don't. That's right. Okay. That makes sense. Oh, a shrine. Can you cure my diseases? Thank you. Okay. Well, that should have removed the disease. It's a bunny! Ah! <laughs> that was a little bit overkill, wouldn't you say? Yeah, okay. They won't attack me. That's right. Wolfkin Alliance. Hi. You're awesome, but I'm better. My fucking eyes. <laughs> oh man, this makes werewolves so fucking cool looking. This is just one skin. Like, this is a bunch. Whoa, my fucking leg. What is wrong with my leg? You saw that, right? Uh, I don't know what's wrong with my leg, but it's doing some. Oh, I guess it's just the angle at which it's hitting the ground. It looks really strange. Rightfully so. Uh, we got another perk. Roar of Terror would be useful. But I actually think we'll do this because of the passive 25% physical damage uh, buff. Ah. So that gives us an additional power when we roar, when we have our sh uh, claws sheathed. So basically, we can slow down time. I kind of wish that was automatic, though, but that's the workaround. Like, in Moonlight Tales, the newest version, with... And mind you, normal Skyrim. What the fuck? Is it Ice Wraiths? Yeah, there's one over there. Um, with Moonlight Tales, the newest version. Oh, he killed himself. I was gonna attack him, but then he just died. Um, with the newest version, you can basically um, apply a patch for uh, was it Werewolf Mastery? And I guess uh, the creator Brevi of this decided. This time around, he's going to incorporate a lot of features of that mod into the perk tree. So the slowdown is definitely one of them. It's kind of like the vamp better vampires, where sometimes I can slow down time. In this case, it's the same thing, only I have to activate it. There's no script extender to effectively get the werewolf to do that. 
Theoretically, theoretically, um, you could make it so a werewolf's power attack slowed down time. But that would be kind of annoying because every time you did that, the t time would slow. And this could break the game and otherwise be annoying because every time you go to attack, you, you just stop. So, um, yeah, that's, that's pretty tedious. So it's kind of cool that you can activate a buff that does it sporadically. There is there's ways to script it so that a buff will happen. And the moon is full, so I'm curious if we actually have that... Uh, the other buff applied to us right now. Resistance. In any case, it's going to help us out on full moon nights. Uh, and since we transform every night, this is definitely something that's going to help us. Yeah, nice. oh. And we have a chance of getting a normal wolf as well, which is cool. I like it. Oh. We killed it. No! <laughs> he almost got set on fire. <laughs> oh, look at those fire salts. Oh, look at those poor bastards down there. Ripe for the slaughter. Well, I'm going to end this episode here. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you're enjoying this other series of Skyrim. I didn't want to do too much Skyrim, but honestly, I am loving this, uh, I'm loving this mod, I'm loving Skyrim Special Edition. I was going to go back to Morrowind for a bit, and I will, but it looks like that's going to have to wait for a little bit. Um, unless you have input on that matter, um, I enjoy playing them both, and I'm very excited to see where this mod goes, the new Moonlight Tales, definitely, uh, my favorite mod in existence it's so fucking awesome for skyrim um if you like this you know click the like button if you didn't whatever <laughs> subscribe if you haven't already and i will see you all later